And welcome back to The Long Dark. I am The Shoe, and we are continuing the Whiteout Challenge, which we are doing very well in. Very well indeed. Alright. Look at our journal, just to recap, I do have the rifle. I think I need a couple more cartridges, though, because I've been, you know, hunting. We got a lot of food. Um, I'm going to go fishing to finish off the food. But now we just need a lot of... We just need a lot of wood and a hatchet. Uh, let's check the weather. Weather is good, but uh, not good weather on the way. So, uh, let's check our backpack. Well, we got some weight we could probably drop off, so let's let's drop some stuff off here. Don't need two wet stones. Oh wait, wrong way. <laughs> um, keep that just in case we need to start a fire somewhere. Actually, no, because we're going to be starting a fire. So, or we're going to be picking up wood. So, if we go pick up wood, we don't need to carry wood. We'll transfer five. Keep one on us. Um, we tear those up. Okay. Do, do, do. First aid is fine. I hope we're wearing shoes. Uh, I hope we can make a couple more fishing tackles. Yep, I think we're good. Our deer hide is finally cured. Drop our guts that we have. Come on. There we go. Wrong button. Uh, we want to drop you. Fair enough. This and handy. we'll pick all those up and put them away. Cool. Uh, let's grab a couple little snacks. Not out of that drawer. There we go. And I'm already. Okay. Uh, let's get ready to do this. Um, we're going to go back to the east today. Hopefully. That's the plan. All right, looks innocent enough. All right, let's do this. Get a little move on here. Um, <laughs> we should probably be going through the forest, though. 
Because I gotta pick up sticks and all that good stuff. Well, unless I can find some sticks like right over here. There's some. down. Four hours of daylight left, so I need to be a little careful how much time I'm spending on things. Are we getting cold? I don't know, we're just getting tired. Looks like the fog's about ready to roll in, too. But, it's just a nice little peaceful walk. I think I've said it a couple times, but I'll say it again just because, but this is an absolute beautiful game. I mean, just look at the graphics. It's beautiful. The sounds are crisp. I mean, you could really make this into a horror game very, very easily. I mean, some people might even categorize it as a horror game already just because of the isolation, of always having to be paranoid for wolves and bears and other problems that may arise. What? <laughs> Speaking of wolves... I believe he was right on cue. What time we got? Four hours of daylight. Do we want to stay here or head to the next settlement? Uh... Let's push forward. I thought we fixed you. All right, be ready. Wait for him to pounce. And hightail it in the other direction. <laughs> okay, it looks like you might leave us alone now. to rest. Yeah, I know, you're getting tired. Just need to try to push to that fishing settlement. 
Which was the furthest east we went, so... Then again, I don't know if that's really east or not, but... It's my east. <laughs> Actually, where's the sun? The sun's setting that way, the sun sets in the... Hey, I might have gotten it right, actually. It might not be perfect east, but it's... Do enough to east. Then again, we're in Canada, so I don't think the sun's technically in the same position that it is when you're in America. Then again, I'm in Ohio, so it's close enough to Canada. Oh, it's starting to get a little difficult. Let's check in here real quick, even though the door's open, so... Yep. She's empty. Yeah, the weather turned very quickly. Three hours of daylight left, but easily approaching no daylight. Um, let's pick a house, pick a house. Let's pick this one. Let's see what we got. Yeah, and I believe I've picked through all of these already, so... Empty, empty. Yep. Already picked through. So I'll get rid of the flare. And... Do our bedtime things. Let's eat the peaches. Actually, wasn't doing that bad on food. A 90 calorie energy bar. That, that'll do. Drink up some water. And, uh... I've not been wearing my boots. I've literally been walking in my socks. Wow. Good one. Good. Good, good, good. Glad, uh... Glad I was doing that. I'm gonna take off all of our wet stuff. I wonder why my socks are wet. Anything that needs repaired? Nope. And nothing at that. So clothing as well, we can make some fishing tackle. One more. We can make this, this dressing wound. It's supposed to be a little better than the bandage, I guess. Bandages, tinder plugs. No, don't want to do any of that. But I do want to rip up the newspaper. And the newsprint. And we're pretty much out now. And I believe that is. That is our warning saying, hey, it's time for bed. So yeah, I used a lot more ammo than I thought I did. A lot more ammo than I thought I did. Yeah, I got five rounds. Five cartridges, meaning I need to get five more. Just put the gun away. Alright, time for bed. Two hours of daylight, ten hours of darkness. Means let's try to sleep for 12 hours. Get a 
full night's rest. Wait, what? Oh, that must have really been a quick 12 hours. Yeah, that was a really quick 12 hours. Okay. Let's eat our beef jerky. Drink our water. Which that might actually finish off our water. And 0 0.01. That'll do. That will do. Alright, flares. Only got one. Maybe I should have picked up a couple more flares. Ah, we'll be alright. Eh, doesn't look terrible. Does it look great? No. Ow. Doesn't look great, but doesn't look terrible. All right, into the depths unknown. Head over to this little fish hut. See what we got over here. Ooh, a little underpass over here. Maybe that's what I was seeing. Because I remember I said when I went to like this little house over here that there was something I couldn't see over there. Maybe it was that uh oh, that is water. Maybe it was that uh bridge. I cannot see a thing in here. Ooh, there's a soda. Oh, no. Come on. No. Okay, here we go. Bam. <laughs> I know you're cold, but you can pick up a can of soda. And nothing in there. All right. Back outside. Do I want to go over the bridge? Yes, I do. There's a car on the bridge. So let's go to the bridge and see what we got. Might be something on the or er, under the bridge too. So after I check up here. We'll go back down and see what's under the bridge. Oh. Well, that snow pile looked like a car. Oh, there's a car. Yeah, yeah, there was a car all this whole time. Believe it. Getting cold? Yeah, it's a little cold outside. I don't know why I took those. Don't need them. Uh, nothing in the back seat, but hey, there's something in the front seat. Just saw something run across. I didn't see what it was. Whoops. Probably a bunny. We're, we're gonna call it a bunny. Uh, one of these days, there will be something. Oh, yep, little bunny. Lots of sticks. Pick them all up. No, stick. And let's continue to push. Plenty of daylight, and I am getting met with a lot of resistance. I almost have to run just to move forward. Mm 
Yeah, lots of resistance. It was supposed to be a uh, either category one or two today. I'm not sure which one it was. At risk for frostbite. Well, that's you know, that's always good. Rockfall. Great. There was nothing over here that entire time. Cool. Oh yeah. Why don't I actually put all my clothes on? And another pair of socks. Checking. There. That feels like 16. It's a little better. This looks like something. What do we have this way? A little pond. Oh no, that's the uh, that's the underpass. Okay. Ooh. Well, let's follow the water path, shall we? Cold is making my head feel thick. Your head feel thick. Can't say I've been that cold. I have no clue what that sound was. Lots of creepy sounds. I don't like it. See now, just like I'm following the path of water, so would other animals. So... Hopefully, hopefully I'm alone. Some cattails. I just want to find a building. So cold. Yes, I know you're cold. Just want to lay down. No. Oh. Bear Creek Campgrounds. No. No, no. That does not sound fun at all. Doesn't mean I won't search, but... Come on. There we go. Stay. Ah. Oh. Pfft. That looked like firewood to me. Yes, I know you're getting hungry. Yeah, it's still you. K. 
can't hear anything with you clippity clacking. We are freezing, we're getting winded, we're hungry. We're miserable at this point. Looks like another bridge. Let's go for it. I at least need a car right now to warm up. We'll go that way. Come on. Up the hill. Got up here. Uh, if I can get up here, come on. Oh, railroad tracks. Cool. Let's follow the railroad tracks. Oh, no more running for me. But it is almost 30 degrees, so we'll, we're almost to the point where we'll start warming up. Uh-oh. Wait, it was snowing real bad, now it's sunny. So maybe the weather change was, it's now sunny. But I see a building. So we're heading for that building. Oh, but first, is that is that a hatchet? <gasps> yes, it's a hatchet. Oh yes. So that means we can now cut wood. We can make our own firewood. Finally. So, we can start cutting our own wood. Freezing. Uh, it is 62 in here, so we will start warming up. Put the, that away so I don't try to continuously light it. Uh, sure, we'll pick it up. All I can think about is food. I uh, don't need another... Well, it could be better, so... We'll take it. Now anything that's wood's gonna pop up. Do you want to tear this down? Since I have a hatchet. Um, but the answer will be, yes, I want to tear everything down. Nothing in the crate. But what I'm planning on doing, at least for a lot of the wood, like um, all the reclaimed wood that we need, I'm going to go back to the uh, back to our little home base that we have where the garage is. And we will um, just raid the houses, just tear everything down in the houses. So that will that will be fine. And that's something that we can do on, you know, bad days even. Um. So we're starting to not be numb anymore, but we are still very tired. A lot of daylight left. Maybe I shouldn't have drank something. MRE. We do need a lot of food. Let's do it. Tough, not very, very, not very filling, but at least edible. 
Alright, so that is that. Uh, we might want to catch some Z's in here. But that'll do it for this episode of The Long Dark. It was a long episode, sorry for that. Uh, but uh, hey, we got our hatchet. Knocked off another check mark in our journal as long as we can get it home safely. As long as I can get home safely. I need to get home safely. <laughs> um, so yeah, thanks for watching. I'm The Shoe, and if you like this video, make sure you uh, give it a thumbs up, comment, and if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe. Um, got a lot, whole bunch of new stuff coming out this week, so definitely uh, want to check that out. And we, uh, The Kerbal Space Program, a lot of people have liked it, so make sure you watch that too if you want. Uh, but hey, I'm The Shoe, and until next time, uh, take care all.